me, oh my, oh my, my, my. Oh my goodness gracious. Three, two, one, go. Hello. Hi. Goodbye. Oh. <laughs> I did it. I started an episode. I'm just any of that crap disqualifies himself from the race. Probably. I win! <laughs> Wait, no! Oh, so I'm Towards just like... Time. <laughs> I'm just like... Disqu <laughs> automatically disqualified too? Yep, wow. you, you're, you're Crab Master, aren't you? Oh. Oh, oh! oh! I guess so. If that makes so, you happy. Um, I have two topics for this episode. Are they hot topics? Uh, yes, because I am in Lethal Lava Land. Are they cold topics? Crab, why do we keep no. following each other around? I went to the basement too. <laughs> oh, interesting. Um, so my my first topic is so because Tor always syncs his audio with um. <laughs> Go ahead, say it. <laughs> so because that such things happens, um, I I I I, I need to know. Uh, the the world needs to know. Wiping sitting down or standing up. <laughs> The biggest debate of the universe, how, apparently. I don't see how you could be able to wipe sitting down, to be honest. Unless, I mean, using a it, bidet is a different thing, but... How, how about you, Alti? Uh, standing up. Okay, I'm, so I'm a stand-up well, kind of lizard. <laughs> I, I suppose we're all very similar people. It's a strange debate. We're the, the same the person. That... Confirmed. Oh, oh no. Mario. Wait, so this is just a let's play? I mean, it is a let's play. It's let's play number 83. Oh, that's oh. my favorite number. 83? Let's play number 83. 83. Super Mario 64 DS versus. It's let's, let's, play, let's play 83. But, it, let's but it's play his favorite 83 number. Let's play Mario versus. Whoa, that weird splashy bunny sound. <laughs> Oh gosh, I need to go back upstairs. I need to be Yoshi. Crud. Okay, I'm not doing this now. Um, so, uh, ah, it, it, well. <laughs> it's, a, it's a strange, it's certainly a strange debate. Um, just because, like, apparently the people that do one don't understand how people do the other, and vice versa. But I, I am the master race of people that does both. Now, oh. I, I used to. I I used to only. Uh, I do not want to hear about the specifics. <laughs> it's the most too bad. Crab is going way. to in entertain you anyway. Uh. <laughs> it is the most efficient method, because because see the problem is when you stand up, that's when you get the poopy butt. <laughs> Wait, so you don't it, get the poopy butt when you defecate. Well, not actually entirely, because, like, <laughs> see... <laughs> what is this up, conversation? <laughs> when you stand up, it does a sandwiching effect. Thus, you have to wipe <laughs> oh, more. Oh, okay, I get you now. Turn around, but Mario. it's the Thank most you. terrible, inconvenient thing. <laughs> it's the most terrible, inconvenient time of the year. I, 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 right I gotta now. say, I wasn't expecting to talk about this of all things. This <laughs> Tor, it's Mario. it's, it's kind of your own fault. I didn't, I didn't initiate the conversation. You initiate <laughs> the idea in, Cra in Crab's mind. That's his fault, not mine. <laughs> and I have to use my platform for good to inform people how to be the cleanest selves. <laughs> be because you, you do the first sitting and then the rest of them standing because it's m way cleaner and convenient for your hand that that's that's all that's important in life also you can use three cubes of cubes of <laughs> three, three cubic, cubic tons, tons of scorpions <laughs> to clean your butt <laughs> ouch you can use three squares for four wipes the most efficient way to do it without ever rewiping. It depends on what kind of toilet paper you have, to be honest. Well, if you have like a well, Sherman brand, then probably. Even even my really cheap stuff, because the first thing you do is you fold it, then you wipe, then you fold it, then you wipe. 
You fall it, then you wipe. You get a minimum of three out of that. And then, if things are getting nice and clean, that's when you get the fourth. And you save the trees. Cool. You hear that, everybody I... who... Ooh, that looks very close. This is, this is my soapbox, because it's actually slightly frustrating as someone that like, does not go through toilet paper, like, ever. <laughs> but I live with day, two man. people. I, I kind of do want to upgrade to that one day, definitely. Yeah. Um, I have nothing to add to this conversation. <laughs> you better not! <laughs> this is my soapbox! <laughs> Soaped and clean. Yeah, oh yeah, make sure to use that soapbox. Hopefully there was soap in it, because you need to use soap. <laughs> Just use ass. the box! It's fine! Uh... Uh, the cardboard might hurt. <clears throat> I'm not talking about oh, the box, I'm talking about the soap that was in the box. I'm talking <laughs> about the box. That's the most efficient method. Okay. <laughs> okay, anyway. <laughs> um, I'm not Please illegal Please continue with land. your butt story. No, I'm actually done. Forever. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Until I maybe talk about this Please don't burn your butt, Mario. There, that's my oh, conversation. Oh, he's, he's burning. That would be a... That, wouldn't that... Would that not technically be an efficient way of cleaning your butt? Burning it? it on fire. Yeah. Uh, no, because you light everything else on fire in the meantime if you accidentally fart while doing it. Oh, yeah, that's true. Just make sure you, like, get all that out of your system first, then. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, Alti, <laughs> don't forget to uh, name this the worst episode. <laughs> <laughs> that 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 uh, episode is our, title has been already used and the and so since this isn't Sonic Generations, I'm not going to be reusing an episode title. Sorry. The even worse. Can episode. you call it the butt episode? The butt of the joke. That you haven't called an, uh, an episode the butt episode yet. Probably not. <laughs> but I also have Ooh. like 2,300 videos, so. I, like, reusing an episode name, like, you can use a name once per Let's Play. Like, Sonic Generations was a long enough ago that you could reuse a name. It wasn't it? That was like a couple years ago, wasn't it? I that think was, was less OCC. than two years ago. It was. It came yeah. near the tail end of 2018. So, exactly. in, relatively speaking, it was forever ago. Because literally, like, a hundred years of history has happened in the last six months. He's up there, I think. Okay. <laughs> Luigi! I, yeah, I can't agree more with that. Luigi! I need you to swim! You need for you. me! Luigi, I always I found this the... weird, spongy corally stuff in Dire Dire Docks to be really weird. If not oddly off-putting, because it does not feel like you should just, like, be able to go through it. I guess they changed oh. around a lot of this, because there used to be four down here. Now there's not. Oh, are you getting the chests? What? Are... Oh, are you not also in Dire Dire? No! Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing towards Nightmare awesome. Star. Oh. Oh, really? Yeah. My, um, the Hazy Maze Cave? Yes. Lazy Maze Cave. I'm glad I'm not doing the Hazy Maze Cave anymore. I'm glad <laughs> you're can't. doing the Hazy Maze Cave right now. Wake up, Tor. <laughs> you're in a coma. <laughs> you never woke up Hazy. after falling down the first pit. <laughs> it's wow, been seven this... years. Yeah, this whole seven years has been. Just <laughs> We've been uh, on. waiting on call the entire time, though. Like, you know, we're really patient. Also, when you before the ep the last episode began, when you were waiting for a half an hour, you said a half an hour, but it's actually like seven years. I'm impressed. Oh, what well, was a half an hour on top of it? Okay, a half an hour and s or yeah, <laughs> and seven, seven years, years and a half exactly. An hour. It's actually pretty well timed. That half an hour was just us waiting for you to wake up for half an hour, because you were starting to, like, show signs again. Wow. You're like Link from Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Tor! Can you- Tor! <laughs> open, open your, your eyes. eyes! Wake up, Tor. 
Wake up, Tor. You've been asleep for one hundred dollars. Wow. A hundred whole dollars. Someone gave me a hundred dollars to go to sleep, man. For a hundred years. For a hundred years, um, I wouldn't. Ha I wouldn't be able to use the money, so probably not. Never take a deal like that, cause could like the inflation is just gonna like ruin that money. It's not gonna be worth it. A hundred dollars is gonna buy you a soda in a hundred years, man. <laughs> Actually, become... you can. If you assume inflation continues at about two percent per year, someone that's smarter than me could probably do the math to figure how much a hundred dollars is going to be worth in a hundred years. Well. You said 2% every year, so that's 20% in 10 years, is it not? Yeah, I guess maybe. So 20% well, no, of wait, 100 no. is 20. See, so. see, it's 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 not like just added on. It's 2% of where it is now, so you have to do like you know 100, 2% of uh, so like that's 98. But then what's like 2% less of 98, and then that's 2% less of what's yeah, it gets complicated, and at a I certain see. point you have, like, a billion decimal places because life hates us. <laughs> That's just the way the nature rolls. Why is Hazy Maze Cave, like, the Wario level? <laughs> it kinda is. I always so I have a- you know what, here's another vivid memory I have of this game. I remember in my old house, um, playing Hazy Maze Cave that- uh, with Wario, or no, it was Yoshi with the Wario hat, and I was riding Dory in, um, ah, in, in, while well, playing in my living room. Wow, Dory was in your living room? Yeah. Nice. Oh, I would love a no. giant Dory. Nice Gosh. negative. <laughs> puff, puff, positive. <laughs> puff. Mario puff. currently is the puff, puff, positive. This is In... zero fun. That's my my stance. <laughs> <laughs> for those oh. of you who don't know what we're talking about, um, I don't even know what to search on YouTube for that. I feel like you could just like put those words uh, in. Yeah, uh, it's it's like it's a it's a it's a metaphor for like um, slopes. Slopes like mathematical, mathematical. Slopes. I don't even. I don't. I really don't even get like. I, I, I need to like rewatch that or something because I don't actually get it. <laughs> <laughs> it's still on like, YouTube. You don't need I, to I get watched it. it. Not too long ago. Um, but I watched that. I think it was like my sophomore year of high school, and high school. Like, of high. Did I say high school? Yeah. So. And we watched it like a billion times because it was so funny because the guy doing the voiceover like stuttered on his line <laughs> and he like brushed it off as nothing. I'm just trying to think like what what is this used for? I mean I never went to high school because I'm an uneducated troglodyte. Well look, take a Wait, take a right graph there? and make a slope. Yeah. Take a giraffe. You go up and you go up and up. So like puff puff positive. When the slope goes up that means it's a positive number, but when it goes down, it means it's a negative number. But, but, but that's if like... If it stays the same level... Is this high then, school? I, I think it was yeah. for, like, a skier. Yeah. And that's why he was going, like... Oh, yeah, yeah, the metaphor is, like, it's a guy going up a, a snowy mountain, and he's skiing. And the nice negative is, like, him going down the slope, and he's like, nice, because he's skiing. I suppose I'm just trying to figure out, like, what this is, like... It's just maybe it's just because it sounds like a simple concept that wouldn't need like a weird demonstration. I don't know. I mean, it's, ah! it's sophomore level high school, um, extra. so we're all dumb kids at that. Crab, are you doing okay? <sighs> Warrior went under. He's just the having star. so much trouble wrapping his mind around slopes. Maybe he yeah, should watch the video. Uh... Yeah, just watch a video and it all makes sense. I mean, yeah. I'll, I'll definitely, it's some, like, I should just give it another look just to see if there's, like, any reason that it needs to be described this way. It doesn't. <laughs> but it makes it you remember makes it. It makes things fun. Yeah. It, it sure does, question mark. Where is the star? In my pockets. 
No, not your stars. Oh my stars! Is it over here? I can't. It's, that's the thing about TikTok Clock, right? Is that you don't know what is above you and what's supposed to be below you. I think that's above right. me, though. I think it's right over here. Oh, yeah. stars on there. This is a, oh, no, it's not. Never mind. I guess I hadn't considered that. Oh, crud. I still have the hundred coins. Oh, crud. Oh, crud. <laughs> Ow. Oh, I'm not doing that Shit. now. Oh. <laughs> oh, where is it? Yoshisaurus wrecked. <laughs> okay, so I'm going back to, um... Uh, uh, uh Lethal Dire Land. That's two different oh, it's levels. Oh, right here, okay. I know. Right. No, it's not. Uh, what? so what I was gonna this? talk about... I, I was thinking about the levels in this game, and I was wondering to myself how they would look not in a remaster, because a remaster would probably try to keep a lot of things... Oh, that's what's oh, it's right there. there. Um, oh, wait, would I... try to keep things, like, relatively... Like, the same? Oh, I need Wario. Um, but, like, I I guess, um... I, I was thinking how, if this game was made, like, in modern times... They would have designed some of this stuff. Like, I, I think about Lethal Lava Land, and I feel like it probably wouldn't look like it was in like a weird lava ocean. But instead, I feel like it would probably look like it was like either on top of like a volcano, like where oh that'd be like, cool. It's, it's oh, there's just two things in there. Like a, dripping God, over. I gotta go all the way again. <laughs> <laughs> like a Breath of the Wild style Death Mountain area. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because, like, I'm thinking, like, it would be, like, a lava pool on top of a volcano. The level would probably be a little more, like, circular-ish. That'd be neat. Um, but, yeah, or Another reason it would why be I want in a the... valley. Another reason why I want the, um, the rumors to be become true. It looks so cool in HD. I'd love to see Yeah, I do, their... like, wonder how far they would go, because... Obviously, this is me thinking about, like, if they just straight up completely recreated the concept. Um, yeah. Now, now what I is also... a Mario? But a miserable pile of stars. <laughs> He's, is he miserable? A little bit. Whoa! Oh, Tor disagrees. Um, yeah, go ahead. I also... Oh, jeez, thanks. I, I Where are all these silver stars coming from? What the hell? You're doing that level. <laughs> <laughs> that <Don't> time. <laughs> we immediately oh, God, know God. what you're doing. Wow, I'm glad I'm glad that's like a thing. Wait, so where's this silver? Oh no, it's right there! Yeah! I think if they fall off the edge, they just respawn. <laughs> Alright. Well that was easy. <laughs> Oh, Bob, I need no. Wario for this. <sighs> oh, I, I never needed Wario for this. <laughs> Hazy Maze Cave Wario. is not a well-designed level. Hazy Maze Cave. I like the I like the layout of the level, but it's just. I think it's annoying be because there's too much in the freaking cavern. Mm. Like the rest of the level is fine. It's just the cavern sucks. And, like, in this game especially, it's worse because you have to go in and do it an extra time! <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, but yeah, the other thing I was gonna say about Lethal Lava Land... Uh, I can- I can definitely- Oh, Mario, imagine... no! <laughs> what the heck was that? Oh. Uh, I can definitely no! imagine the sort of modern Nintendo aesthetic to all of the different platforms and everything. I definitely imagine the volcano in the middle would be larger. Definitely, like, larger with a couple platforms to get up it. And oh, I definitely. feel like the rotating thing around it would probably be replaced with, um... A spiral? What? A spiral going up it? The platforms? No, no, no. I kind of imagine... I, it, it's one of those things where I've got, like, the mental picture in my head of the types of platforms Nintendo would use. Uh, where, where it's... It's hard to describe, but it's it's like those crusty circular lava 
platforms that kind of sink into the lava. Sort of like, like the like things something... that are in King Caliente? Uh, maybe. I, oh. mm, I'm trying to remember. I literally just played a lot of this stuff, but my brain is mushy. Um, well, like unmushy it then. <laughs> oh, dang it. Oh, why am I having trouble now? I gotta focus. Woo, careful. Um, but yeah, I imagine those kind of going around the thing in a circle, basically. But yeah, th those are just my thoughts of, like, modern... Well, I've got a lot more thoughts than that, but it's like... Ah, oh, wrong way! Ah! <laughs> careful now. <laughs> just like you told me. Oh, I'm dead. Four minutes remain. Don't die. Oh, really? Dang. I know, right? You can get out of here alive, Crab. No, I can't. Oh, yeah, that brings me right back here. Nice. But, You're um. All on top of me. Come on, just drop. I definitely. Like, I, th I think one thing I was thinking about is what the puzzle would look oh. like in a modern remake. And I definitely feel like they would probably have a very stylized Bowser. But also, like, it, it's weird. I imagine the puzzle pieces looking more mechanical or very puzzly. I feel like they'd use that, um, oh man, I can't remember the artist's name, but that Mario artwork that you see, the 2D Mario artwork that's standard um, with Mario games now. I think they'd use a portrait of Bowser for, like, in that style. Yeah, I suppose they would probably go with the... Yeah, that style. I, I I guess it depends on if they like lean into any sort of aesthetic, like how um we we got the um what's the right term for the the aesthetic that they used in the Bowser level in Odyssey, oh. where they just leaned heavy into like, oh like a Japanese style. Yeah, yeah. Um, Camera, please. You, the very What's like wrong show with camera? Bowser. <laughs> um, so it's like I I don't know what kind of thing they would do if they gave uh, this world a little more stylization for stuff like that. Yeah, so you're saying like if they made it not just like a volcano, but like something like a stylized thing on top of being the volcano. Yeah. Well, I mean that's uh, not even necessarily a Bowser level. Well, yeah. Unless well, it's, it's, it's got a Bowser. Team. Um, it's it's got a Bowser puzzle, <laughs> I guess. I'm yeah. just wondering with eight pieces what they would do to the Bowser. Also, just gen generally think that they probably would make it look like a really nice puzzle, <laughs> because like in all of the older, like even this one, it's kind yeah. of really just a picture of Bowser from like a folder somewhere in their offices. <laughs> I oh, agree. Okay. That's awesome crap. <laughs> hmm? Wait, is that it? Oh, that's it. Alright, tick tock clock is down. Flaming silver stars. Flaming hot Cheeto stars. A minute and a half. I wish I could still eat Cheetos. Why can't you? Wait. Can't eat cheese huh? right now. Haven't been able to oh, for like a year. Oh. Huh. L like, just lactose? Or is it cheese itself? For now, it just seems to be cheese. It, we, I, I also thought it was like butter and milk and stuff, but I think I'm getting better at eating those things. My body is kind of huh. recuperating. Anyways, Hazy Maze Cave and the metal cap are completely cleared out for me. Nice, Good dude. beans. I'm so happy. And that I still have a minute Hazy to Maze do Cave. something here in Lethal Lava Land. Well, oh, can I get those silver stars now? Uh oh. What? Oh, spaghetti. Bros. My spaghetti is owed. My spaghetti is meatbo. Oh no! Oh no! I have 50 seconds. Oh crud! This would have been an easy star if I didn't mess it up. I hope we go in overtime. Come here, oh. Billy. Come on, Mario. Oh, you Yoshi, why do you slide that way? Why are you Yoshi today? I can make it. Oh yeah. I can make it. All right, 20 seconds. 20 seconds. I think I'm gonna get this beforehand. Cause I don't like oh, waiting. Oh man, please do. 
<laughs> I almost missed the star. All right, I got it. We still have ten seconds. Ten seconds. Oh, oh my gosh. I I mean, what am I what am I thinking? I'm not gonna be able to. Because I'm a gambler, I might be able to get another star. You're a rambling, gambling man. Oh. Time don't do this time is me. here. So next star is it. Okay. Oh, I hate this alarm. It like takes all my other sounds. And Stargate. Huh. No. Well, oh well. I guess it's time for me to nosedive. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Goodbye, Tor. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm back here. Yay! Oh, and I'm, I'm back here. That was another another I'm well done episode for me. Oh, nice God. work, Tor. I'm at 79. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Oh yeah, 79. What are you at, Crab? <laughs> I am at 107. I'm at 117. Oh gosh, how did he get such a star lead? Because <laughs> uh, I, 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 I spent a long time in Hazy Maze Cave and just kind of cleared that entire thing out. Also, one of my things was a toad star. <laughs> oh. Okay. What? Okay. okay. Anyways, bye-bye, well, another... everybody. Yeah. Bye-bye. See you next episode. I hope you are here with us tomorrow. Not tomorrow, because it's not how a schedule works. Me Go too. Go watch Ori and the Blind Forest, too. <laughs> That's awesome crap. <laughs> the Blind and Deaf Forest. Wait, isn't that another game? What? I don't know. <laughs> Goodbye!